Howdy y'all, Boston with Defender Tactical. Today we're going to be doing an updated installation video over our rail mount solutions for Mossberg 590 and 500, which includes the Maverick 88. Um, so these are both very simple and similar installation videos, so we decided to include them into one video with a few updated instructions. Um, so we'll go ahead and get these out of the package and discuss them a little bit, and then we will get right into the installation. All right, here are the rails themselves. On my left here, we have the 590 rail. On my right, we have the Maverick 88 and 500 rail. These are both machined from solid 6061 T6 aircraft grade billet aluminum, so they're very solid. Um, the 590 rail we offer in dual and tri rail, as well as three other Cerakote color match colors. We have black here. We also offer flat dark earth, Patriot brown, and stainless. For the Maverick 88 and 500 rails, uh, we only offer these in dual rail currently, um, and they have a black hard anodized coating on them. Um, and as I mentioned, they're both very simple and similar installations, so we'll go ahead and get that started. But first, we're going to check our magazine and our chamber to be sure that we are clear. Looks good. All right, now we're going to start with the 590 rail here. Um, so you're going to take this lug here on the top side and you're just going to line that up with your barrel. Uh, so you're going to have that facing up <clears throat> and then you simply slide it on over the magazine cap like that and then secure it with the stud and the nylon washer. Now you want to get this as finger tight as you possibly can for now and then we'll come back and tighten it up in a second. For the 500 rail you want to take the little cutout right there Place that over the magazine retaining screw and secure that with the stud and nylon washer. All right, now once you've got it as hand tight as you can, you want to take something like a screwdriver um, and fit it into the stud hole and give it just another eighth to a quarter turn. You want to be careful not to strip it out. Um, and then if this is your first time installing this, uh, you may want to give it a day or so for that nylon washer to relax out and then come back and um, just snug it down one more time to be sure that it is tight. But after that, you shouldn't have to worry about it. Uh, or you can use some blue Loctite if you'd like on the initial install just a little bit and um, you should not need to worry about retightening after that. Um, so I think that is going to about cover it, guys. As I mentioned, very simple. Hope this helps. Uh, let me know what y'all think about it in the comments. Thanks for watching.